Here's the fascinating reason why your dog rolls in crap. Ew! You see how some people treat their dogs? The dogs get spoiled. They're washed and they're shampooed regularly. And then it doesn't end there. Dogs will get blow dried. You know, they're looking all sleek and amazing and windswept. You can even buy dog perfumes. Timmy Hole Digger, that exists. Did you know that? And the dogs look and they smell absolutely fantastic. What do they do? They go and roll in the most disgusting thing that they can find, and they seem very happy about it, don't they? Very pleased with themselves. And look, our own dog Lewis, our white golden retriever, is no exception. Some of the stuff that he's come back covered in, and we live on a farm, a sheep farm. So, whew, sometimes it's gross. But there is a reason. Human beings understand the concept of camouflage, but of course we're visual creatures. So for example, soldiers will disguise themselves as the terrain they're in, so they don't get seen, so they can sneak up on their enemy and hide from their enemy. In a similar way, dogs, using their sense of smell as their dominant sense, know that if they blend in with the area that they're in, but in a smell, then they're gonna be hidden. They can sneak up on their prey. And they share this characteristic with their ancestors and with their wild counterparts. So the next time your dog rolls in something absolutely putrid, my tip is to wash it off with water until you can't smell it anymore. Remember, when a dog rolls in something that smells really bad, in its mind it's thinking, now I'm a ninja. If you'd like to know more about what your dog actually thinks, then go to my website, tonynightdoglistener.com, and maybe get the Think Like a Dog ebook. It could just revolutionize your relationship with your dog.